The donors are, are hand in hand with the children. They're in the classrooms, they're seeing the kids face to face, they're really understanding why their dollars are working and the Big Shoulders mission becomes a hand to hand face-to-face -face experience. There's something incredibly powerful about being able to come to the classrooms and meet the children. It's not just stroking a check, which is all important. We, we need people to give money, but what's so powerful and, and in many respects a, a real way for us younger professionals to be involved is to come out to these parts of Chicago that we wouldn't ordinarily visit, that we maybe didn't even know existed and you you come to these schools and you meet the kids and you see the reality of the old infrastructure and the need and it really uh, makes it makes you very aware of the power of your impact and uh, and the desire to share the message with others the role of the chairman's advisory council is to fundraise and build awareness for the Big Shoulders Fund and in addition to foster the next generation of leaders and to try to walk in the footsteps of some of the many great civic leaders that are currently involved in the board. We have a very dynamic group of young professionals who have achieved a lot of success in their own professional careers and who enjoy very much being involved with each other and, and I think that creates an energy that helps really motivate and carry us on to fulfilling the mission of Big Shoulders. This is children, this is education, this is making a difference. This is working. These numbers are compelling. The, the fact that we have a fix, maybe small, maybe not going to change the world, but change the world to many families and many individuals. So that. Once you get an ear um, and somebody who has a, a, a passion for children, for education, you know, Big Shoulders sells itself. Big Shoulders Fund, celebrating 25 years of carrying children's dreams.